Okay, we're back. Hello! Welcome back. That's break number two. We're four hours in. Um, honestly, being four hours in, I actually... I'm worried about... Oh, I mean, actually, four hours is... Four hours is fine. Four hours is fine. We got this. We got this. I'm not gonna get discouraged. Um, okay, let's, uh, let's read some more donations, and then we'll get into it. Uh, uh, Captain Xander donated $50 and said, I am also hoping to move out soon, so happy, to, so I'm happy to help with your move. Thank you so much, Captain Xander. Uh, yeah, stay safe on your end. I hope everything goes well. Um, and best of luck. Uh, Snailius donated $50. So first time catching a stream live. I'm moving again soon, too, so here's from me to you. Thank you, Snailius. Also, very good username. I like that a lot, Snailius. Um, Snailius! Uh, Lucina of Stardust donated ten dollars and thirty-one cents and said, "Yeah, thank you." Uh, Kiefer Morler donated uh, five dollars. Uh, Noodles like donated ten dollars and said, "Throws money at Pevy." Ow! <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> uh, Nyar Nyars donated fifteen dollars and said, "Your content has seriously helped me so much with getting through my first year of college." Thank you so much and good luck with the move. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, Yoshi JPEG donated five dollars and said, "Penny, I love you so much, and I wish you the best of luck with your move. Also, happy birthday, Sonic! Kelly, yeah, thank you." Uh, Clarite donated one hundred dollars with no message, but thank you so much. Um, Tonks H donated another twenty-five dollars and said, "Let's go!" Thank you, Tonks. Uh, Trucy donated twenty dollars and said, "Good luck with the move, Penny. Your content makes me super happy and has helped me through a lot. Sadly, I can't donate too much, but I hope it helps. Twenty dollars is so generous. Thank you. It does help. I, I promise you, it helps. Thank you. Um, I mean, this this thirty five hundred we've raised so far is made up of twenty dollars and five dollars as much as it is the hundred dollars. Like that is so kind of you. Um." Trash Mountain donated twenty dollars and said, "Good luck with your move, Miss Penny Parker." Thank you. Uh, Knife Lard donated ten dollars and said, "You make money for a move." That's exactly right. Thank you. Uh, the quietest little bucket uh, donated ten dollars and said, "So I was saving some money in case my friend needed help, but they didn't need it, so now I can help you." Thank you, Qu uh, quietest little bucket. Uh, thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, Evelyn donated another hundred dollars and said, "Do it for love." Thank you. Um, Aww. Oh, yeah, speaking of, you can tell how behind we are in, in reading donations, because that was way earlier when you mentioned um, that raising this money would make it so that you could come and visit me Aww. at my place sooner. <laughs> uh, MyVec13 donated $40 and said, This remake visually looks stunning, and good luck with the move. Thank you. Yeah, I agree. It, it is gorgeous. The art direction of this game really popped off. Uh, Blue Ducky 8 donated $12 and said, You messed up my dollar Rama. <laughs> <laughs> so much. Um, uh, Tom Kenny, yeah, then the Tom Kenny donated two hundred dollars with no message. Thank you. Uh, Paradox thanks, Persona, Tom. thanks, Tom. Paradox Persona donated twenty dollars. Said if someone's looking to move myself, I wish you the best of luck. Thank you so much. Thank uh, you, thank Kira, you. Kira Kasai donated fifty dollars. Said I'm a simple trans being. I see Penny and Marble. I donate. Hell yeah! Thank you so much. Tonks H donated what another one hundred and fifty dollars. Tonks. Said, haha, moving out money, go bird. Thank you, Tonks. What the fuck? That's like that's like a total six hundred dollars at least that they have donated. That's Tonks, amazing. Thank you so much. Um, keep yourself safe, please. I hope you're not, you know <laughs> I I mean I assume you wouldn't be doing this if you couldn't afford it, but I I, I when it when it starts to get to the bigger numbers, I start to get worried about people. But I appreciate it so much. Um J. Romy donated five dollars. Said, "Sorry, it's not much, but I hope it helps." Five dollars is great. If it is what you can do, you have done what you can do, and that means the absolute world to me. Thank you. Um, but Butch Vaporeon donated ten dollars. Said, "Good luck with your move, Penny. Thanks for playing this game. Me and my GF bonded so hard over the original, and I'm so excited to play this with her too." Thank you, Bo uh, Butch Vaporeon. Also, very good username. Um, and stopping point for now, Medusa Babe donated one hundred dollars with no message. That is so generous. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're still like two hours two hours behind the uh, the donation messages, but I hope y'all understand. I am I am doing my best. <laughs> thank you so much. We got a lot of ground to cover though, so let's get back into it. Um, I am also gonna have to figure out next break that we take might be a bit of a longer one. Uh, you know, two hours from now uh, because um, I'm going to have to probably eat dinner around that time just to, you know, keep myself going, so. 
just a heads up there. Uh, I'll do this uh, tree dome mini game, and then I think we'll do the mermelayer next. Oh god. So I had some grocery related escapades. Mm -hmm. Um, I, I I ordered groceries, um, and they got here, and so. I, I have a recipe that I want to make tonight for like a uh, like a garlic pork bowl, and mm -hmm. I'm really fucking excited about it. So it's like a stir fry kind of, but yeah, it's it's I'm excited to make it. Um, I've never like I've never like done a recipe this hard before. I tend to pick pretty easy shit to make um, if I'm doing it for the first time. But basically, the recipe called for uh, like two like. Just, just straight up, just like, just like, chili peppers, mm -hmm. and I was like, ah, those aren't in many like dishes that I make. So I was like, that's okay. I'll just, I'll just order two of them. So I, I go on the the grocery store's website and I see chili peppers, and I'm like, okay, well these look pretty big for what I need. So I'll just get two of them in case I want to make this recipe more than once. So I buy two. Um, turns out that they are. Giant fucking bags of chili peppers. They weren't expensive, but I now have like like the person who shopped for me must think I eat these like Doritos. Like fucking, Holy shit. I just have two giant fucking bags of chili peppers that yeah. I I fucking will not use. I needed two, and now I have two fucking giant that's, bags of them. That's pretty wild. Yeah. How did that How did that work? That couldn't have possibly know. cost the same. Maybe chili peppers are just really inexpensive? I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Weird. All right. All right, that was pretty easy. So on to the... Mermelayer. Mermelayer! Again, I'm sorry for skipping all the dialogue. It's it's the same situation as but that's the let's play we're doing of this game is just I'll do a stream giveaway uh, of chili peppers in case anybody wants just a big old handful of them. Cool. That sounds do it. <laughs> that's not... yeah, do it right now. How am I doing on socks for... Oh, cool. Not bad. All right. Wait. Ba, 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 ba. This isn't a Ray VHS thing, Alexa, because I promised it ironically. Ray was oh. dead serious about sending people VHS tapes and oh. it just never happened. Oh, no. <laughs> also, whoa, the Mermelayer looks cool. I like I like this. I like this updated look. <clears throat> eh, I'm skipping that. I'm sorry. This looks very nice. It's not just any sponge. It's super sponge, soaking up crime. I'm not going to mail people chili peppers. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is not going to happen. This was not a serious offer. More like There's literally flopper. a 0% chance of me mailing people chili peppers. A less than 0% chance, I'm sorry. What the fuck? Yeah, well the picture was of one chili pepper, so I assume that's what I was getting. And usually when products don't match their online description, I am disappointed. But this time I am Now I am just confused. befuddled. <laughs> yeah. How long do fucking chili peppers last? Because I have so fucking oh, the physics many for them. this is all weird. There we go. Do not mail me chili peppers. You don't understand. I don't need them. I already have too many. <laughs> Mm 
I shudder for when you get a P.O. box someday. And it's gonna be filled with chili peppers. Yeah. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> that was the I just imagine good. opening it up and just fucking it's just stuffed to the brim with chili peppers and I like just like dig my hand in and like pull an envelope <laughs> out and it's just like, hey Marble, really like your stuff. <laughs> it's just a <laughs> dripping wet pile of shrimp. <laughs> You really outdid yourself this year. Oh boy, oh boy. You outdid yourself this year. Oh my god. Thomas, you didn't. An iPod. You outdid yourself this year. <coughs> and you know what? It has all your favorite Kenny Chesney songs on it. Oh, I love Kenny Chesney. It's gonna be it's a gonna Kenny be a Chesney Ken Christmas, Christmas this time of year. This time of year. God. I'm so glad that I just, like, just so happened to date someone who also uh, endlessly quotes Balloon Shop. Yeah! Oh, fuck. So far, I'm the only person, I was the only person in my life at the time who had that trait. Yeah. So. Not anymore. I feel not validated. Anymore. Not anymore. How the shit? Oh, come on. <laughs> if I get it, I should get it. Yeah, balloon shop with Olin Rogers. Balloon shop with Olin Rogers right now! <laughs> I'm so confused. How the fuck am I supposed to do this? <laughs> what? I know. <laughs> this is so weird. I can't think of any moves that would make this more possible. Make it make sense! What the fuck? Uh... Well, let's check back down. Oh, I can keep rotating the walkway. That Very was not epic. that was not in the original game. Okay, there we go. So they they definitely did add stuff here and there, which is nice. Yeah, that's cool. Well, it's actually it's it's a little bit not nice in terms of like <laughs> platinuming the game. <laughs> I oh, have to fair. like find multiple. Th I mean, it is nice. It is nice. It's it's fun, uh, but like it does. I, I don't think it should be that big of a deal. It doesn't seem to be too egregious with like the added <coughs> content. Very much just like minor things here and there. Yeah. And that's okay. A. What? <gasps> No, 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 no. What? What happened? No, they took the, they t they changed it. It sucks now. What? No. What? Oh, come on. What happened? I don't understand anything. So, in SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom, when you when you go to the it, it's so funny cuz we literally Chase and I in today's episode of, of Battle for Bikini Bottom on Snapcube, um, commented on this exact thing. In the original Battle for Bikini Bottom, when you're in the Mermelayer and you go up to the part where they keep the invisible boat mobile, um, not only does the does the boat mobile have its own like 
collision specifically to like its form factor. Like you can literally, you can like jump in the seat even. Um, it's a very detailed collision detection, but it's, it, it is still, it is still able to be jumped on when it's not visible because it's not like it just goes away. It's an invisible boat mobile. It wouldn't just disappear. So right. when you when you jump over here, even if you don't even if you haven't pressed the switch, you can still jump on the boat mobile and like 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 you can like still jump in the seat and like the collision is still there and just as detailed as ever. Um for some ungodly reason, they seem to have entirely missed the point of this set piece. Um, because it's not like it's an invisible boat mobile. It's just like it's a boat mobile that disappears <laughs> and you can make Aww. reappear physically. And, and this is a minor thing, but on top of that, it doesn't have the same detailed collision. So it's not even as satisfying to jump on anyway. That's so sad. These are very small things, but it's like, I, I don't, I don't understand how they could mess up that one. Uh, that felt like a very clear, cool little attention to detail thing. Um, I, I mean, it's not important to the quality of the game per se, but like the fact that they missed that, or or maybe not even just missed it, like neglected it, feels kind of bad. It's like it's kind of yeah. sad. That's understandable. Do you want a chili pepper? It'll make you feel better. Absolutely, babe. All right. Get yourself a girlfriend who will offer you a, ch a chili pepper in trying times. <laughs> what? What? Oh, okay. <laughs> That's weird. Oh, goodness. Me stretchy. I got a job for some Honestly, me stretchy. That's fair. I would have said the same thing, but I'm less brave. I understand. We can't all be as brave as I am. Cool. That was almost a guaranteed close call in the original game, so I'm glad it's just a little bit more forgiving. Yeah. Oh, shit. Do you oh. ever think about how Link's Awakening remake for the Nintendo Switch? Yeah. Yeah, Me I too. do. Whoa! Ah! <laughs> they just laid siege to my ass. Did your ass get laid siege to? Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, Bane. I really hate to see it. You do. Whoa! Oh. Shit! Come on. Oh, shit! Tonks H! See you later! Have a wonderful day! Thank you so much for just your insane generosity. I, I, I can't I cannot express how I know I've tried to express this whole time how important this fundraiser is to me, but I I can't. <laughs> I can do my best, but I will always fall short of how important it actually feels. Y'all are epic. Y'all are so epic. Thank you. And yeah, You're by so the way, to anybody who might be just joining us or has joined us recently and isn't entirely clear on what's going on, I'll go ahead and go over the spiel again. Um 
Uh, I am raising money to uh, safely and comfortably move out um, for the first time ever. Um, it is a lot of money that I'm going to need, uh, but it is in the interest of starting from scratch and developing my own uh, independent living space and uh, just making sure I am able to do so without uh, compromising, again, my safety and uh, and the like. Um, so I, yeah, I am I'm raising money for that. Um, over the next couple of weeks, this is not a single stream event. Uh, this is very much uh, going to, you know, be a thing where I, I, I definitely am going to take my time with it. I'm going to put the work in. I'm going to make sure that the streams that go along with this are good streams that you feel comfortable donating to um, if you are in a position to do so. Um, uh, 15,000 is the current goal, and that is a lot, but it is uh, unfortunately necessary, uh, at least to begin with. Um, this kind of shit gets really expensive really, really fast, especially if you're like me who only really has the equivalent of like a few bedroom objects to my name in terms of like furniture and actual like house necessities. Um, otherwise, I am completely starting from scratch. I will most likely need to get my own car. Um, I will, uh, you know, I'll need to cover fees and deposits and uh, save for emergencies and all kinds of shit. Um, so, you know, all, all that to say, um, if you have anything at all to spare, if, if you would like to help at any point during the next couple weeks, uh, potentially even next few weeks, depending on how long this goes, um, then uh, any support is greatly, greatly appreciated. Um, and it, it's really going to go a long way. So, uh, yeah. yeah. I don't, ugh. I hate this puzzle. <laughs> Oh, I think I got it. I think I got it. Nice. Shit, shit. Damn it. You did it. Oh, I needed to talk to him. That's actually so that's for the better. <laughs> How does that puzzle work exactly? Um there are a specific amount of those little turning things. It seems like there is. I want to remember. There is eight. There are eight turny things. Each time you press a button, uh, well, the goal is to get them all facing the middle. Each time you press a button, um, you turn the 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 column of the button you pressed alongside the two columns adjacent to it. Um, Whatever direction they are facing, when you press that button, those three columns face that opposite direction. Um, so it's just you have to you have to get them all facing the middle, uh, which is surprisingly difficult because there are there are an even number of them and an odd number of them turn around every single time you press one of those buttons. Oh, 
Holy shit. Chloe just donated five hundred dollars. Oh Holy fuck! And got us to four thousand. That's amazing. That is over a quarter of the of the primary goal. That Chloe, is so amazing. Holy thank shit! Thank you so fucking much. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> thank you. And this is only the first day. Like, I'm gonna be doing other event streams for this. Like, this is really exciting. So happy for you, baby. Thank you. I'm happy too. There's a sequel to. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> have you ever, um, have you ever seen that, that quote from, uh, film director George Miller, who directed the first Happy Feet movies, um, about how he feels about the possibility of directing a third Happy Feet movie. No, what did he say? He said, he said, and I, I might be misquoting a little bit, or like, not misquoting, but paraphrasing, but essentially he said, if someone were to come up to me and hold a gun to my head and say, Come up with a story for Happy Th Happy Feet Three. I would just say shoot me, <laughs> which I think is so hilarious. Sounds like a really exciting movie. I can't wait to see it. <laughs> it's so funny. He also direct he also directed the Mad Max movies. Yeah, Happy Feet and Mad Max come from the same director, <laughs> so that's the world we live in. There's no way. There's no way. Come on. That sucks. <laughs> this decorative this decorative level design actively gets in the way of this mechanic. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on. <laughs> that Sorry. sucks. <laughs> oh, it's fine. I made it. I'm so proud of you. Oh my gosh. Thanks. <laughs> I'm glad that this is the commentary quality for this very too. important stream of mine. This is just what happens when we do commentary. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, I'll, and to be fair, I am definitely not going super hard and heavy on the energy here because I I recognize this is gonna be a long stream, so I'm not. Yeah. I'm not gonna burn myself super early on. I've been t I've been taking it real easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. <coughs> Oh, the wall jumping in this game is so much better. It's one of the one of the few things that has actually improved over the original is is the wall jumping. Mechanically, that is. Hiya! How are we doing on progress? Whoa, there's only four socks in this? Damn. Works for me. 
We are gonna have to do Mr. Krabs' fucking funny marathon puzzle in this one, though. Which I, I'm going to predict is probably worse in this game. <laughs> Specifically because that puzzle is very physics-based, and physics-based things do not exist in SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrate. Yeah, they may have like dumbed it down too. Yeah. He's so unfortunate. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can believe it. Okay. I don't know why I just reminded myself of like a community <laughs> bit with that which one just that i can believe it like i don't i don't know like that just it just seemed like something that was very community-esque in tone oh yeah we're almost done with season three on our rewatch yeah they def they definitely toned down pierce in season three which is very appreciated yeah. like he just talks less because after oh my god season two pierce is the worst he ever is and you could is... tell that he was not meant to be back in the show and yeah. then he just comes back and then well, all of the people he manipulated and abused start cheering for him like yeah. hello here's the thing Dan Harmon there had to be a way to make that work better yeah here's the thing um I honestly I I always thought season three was my favorite season minus Pierce being an absolute piece of shit though I I think season two is a little better just in terms of like consistent yeah. joke quality. Um, I don't know, season two is really strong in a way that I did not yeah, it's particularly remember it being, at least compared to season three. Um, yeah, I, I would say that like, I mean, I'm enjoying season three because I mean, it's community and it's, yeah, it's great. a really fucking awesome show. And it's not season um, four, so, you know. And it's not season four, which we are watching. <laughs> we, yeah, no, we're gonna watch the whole thing. Yeah. We're gonna watch the gas leak year. Mm -hmm. Which is um, a very funny retroactive joke they do. Yeah. Um, I, 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 I really like season three, mainly uh, chaos theory and- Remedial chaos, yeah. Yeah, remedial chaos theory. It's just the best episode of any show. It's, it is genius. It's like act actively a genius episode. Was the D&D &D episode in season three? No, D and D was uh, season two. Oh. Well, yeah, because D and D, the D and D episode comes literally like right in the middle of the point where Pierce is at his shittiest. Right, right, and is, right, like, right, and is right, like right. actively an antagonist to the group, yeah. but yeah. not in a way that's like really narratively satisfying. Like, yeah. like it's he's still kind of like framed as a protagonist, but he is acting like an antagonist, and so it just. It just kind of sucks well, to watch. Well, that was like one of the turning points is the yeah, D&D sure. episode where, where they're just like, I choose to feel sorry for Pierce. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, and it's, uh, the, the thing about it is that like, you know, he keeps on, he has this story arc quote in season two where he keeps on complaining about being left out of the group. That does not track though when the entirety of his character before that arc is him being needlessly and persistently shitty to not even just the group, to everyone around him, not picking up on any hints whatsoever and actively denying the fact that he has like growth to do. Like, yeah. and, I, and here's the thing is that, I guess that I, I get that's the point of his character, but the fact that he is, like I assume the writers were locked into a position where they still needed to frame him as a protagonist. Yeah. For the show and for like the ensemble cast. And so the fact that the show has this like continued um weird sort of like internal battle with itself almost of like wanting Pierce to be a completely no holds barred shitty person because that is his character and that is what he is there for and that's how he works off the rest of the group dynamically. But they also has to they also have to frame him as a protagonist and come up with reasons for him to still be a part of the group. And all of the reasons they come up with are so ham fisted. Um, yeah. Just compared to like what you actually see him do to the others. Yeah. Um it's ridiculous. Boy. 
Because he's like, just he's just manipulative. Yeah, exactly. Like, he, like that's it. That's his whole character. He's is just manipulative, manipulative bad and person. Like like all the other characters have their own sort of like ways in which they are shitty, which they use a lot to justify There's why he like quote belongs with them. The um, like but no, the 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 difference between Pierce and the rest of the group is consistently just night and day. Yeah. Like, he is actively a bad, shitty, unempathetic person. Um, and it's, it's, it's wild. It is wild. Oh, no, I did that wrong. Fuck. Oh, they, they, they actually have a little indicator now to tell you when you fucked up. That's great. At least I won't be left in the dark about it. I like how there, the, yeah, there's like a whole arc about like how... Pierce's dad like it like it, it's yeah. just like it's like this arc to like garner sympathy for Pierce because his dad is like really shitty and it's like ah uh. yeah what was it? okay yeah I, I I said this like like when that arc started it's or no no this was in season two I it, it's like Pierce Pierce is like is like the message of Bojack Horseman if there were no consequences for any of the shitty things yeah. that he did. Yeah, exactly. The the fact that the fact honestly and it, it is it is that was such a sound analysis that it literally I have like a theory that Bojack <laughs> is as good as it is specifically because it is all of the best things about community in quality. Um yeah. and there are actual like there's actual character growth on a on like a noticeable calculatable scale um specifically in the realm of yeah like consequences for shitty things which community does not have yeah and i'm not i'm not even dunking on community i fucking love community it is such oh a good yeah show. i mean we wouldn't be watching it if we didn't love yeah. it it's hilarious well can't say that we are watching sword out online with chase <laughs> So fuck. Yeah, we need to get back to that. We do. Yeah, we got like what three episodes That's in. Literally, like I, I feel like I never laugh harder than laughed harder than in that first like watch session we yeah. had. Yeah, that was so fun. I love, <laughs> I love the last time we watched with Chase. It was just I think like didn't we like, like I can't remember exactly. It was like one. either one. Or both of us just had just like an intensely shitty night beforehand, and so we that was just me. Fucking... No, that was me. That was that was in the middle of that whole situation I was going through like a month ago. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Or two months That's ago. Right. I don't know. That's however right. long ago that was. Um, I remember because we had a really long talk about it after sort out sort That's out online. Right. Yeah. Anyway, so we just we we just got in a call with Chase and fucking drank and watched Sword Art Online for like an hour. <laughs> yeah. And that was it. God. It's a good time. It is. Okay. This puzzle sucks. It fucking sucks. Are you fucking kidding me? How? How? How am I supposed to make that work? If that didn't work, what the fuck would? I just completely ignored. <laughs> just completely ignored what I was doing. Just completely. Completely? Ugh, oh, I hate this part so much. You know, you know, you know, you know what? You know what, though? What, though? It's not worse than the original. It's only just as bad. <laughs> which is... Well, that's good. Which is fine. Yeah. Not as bad as it could have been. Yeah. It's bad, and that's good. It'll never be good, and that's, and that's not, not bad. that's not bad. There's no one I'd rather be than Funny Ball Puzzle. Funny Ball Puzzle. 
drawn to life I think calling it a puzzle is giving it too much credit. It's just a fucking... It's just bullshit. Hey, babe, remember Drawn to Life Spongebob Edition? I do remember Drawn to Life Spongebob Edition. Good. Wasn't that our <laughs> first stream together? On my channel, at least? Was it? I I can't remember now. I think something like that, Me though. neither. I think that may have been our first stream together on my channel. Somehow I don't think he it was definitely it. one of the first ones. Yeah. Well, it's on the archive, right? Yeah. You know what? I think it was. I think it was. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm remembering now. It definitely it definitely That's was. That's so cute. I know. In fact, if you go back and watch it, there's probably like I probably introduce you at some point. Come on, come on. Okay, okay, God. okay. We were we were so gay. We were so gay before we were gay. Yeah. There we like, go. Just like we 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 hadn't even started dating yet, but we were so gay. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, no, no. God damn it. Oh my god. I hate this so much. This one always sucks. Holy shit. Holy shit and fuck. <sighs> this, this part blows. I got it all the way to the end, and it just... I just couldn't get the fucking shitty bubble bowl past the fan. I do like how they course correct it every once in a while like that. That is, that is better. Actually, 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 this one might be slightly better than the original. Not gonna lie, because the, the occasional course correct, like, like they do with that it's you know it's not clean but it it's better because it is less frustrating yeah it still sucks because this part just sucks like this this is not this is actively not fun to do it never was <laughs> come on come on there you go okay On there. Take care of this funny guy. Funny doggy. Funny doggy. Come on. Okay. No! Oh, oh, okay, okay. That that was what I was supposed to do. Oh my god, that <laughs> was so fucking stressful. I did it! I did it! I'm so proud of you! Oh ah! my god. Okay. Good I, job, li babe. I literally am like tense in my body physically. Hmm. Well, you just did a fantastic, amazing, epic job, babe. We're already almost five hours in. Where the fuck is the time going? Time? Oh, we're almost done with Mermelayer, though. There's no time here. Okay. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, that part, Deep Jungle, sucks for sure. <laughs> I love that that's just a phrase now. Yeah, it's great. Oh, I think I went the sucks. wrong way. Wait, did I? Oh, no, no, I got all... That was, that was, that was, that was all I needed. <sighs> Hell yeah! Woo! I got sleepy arms. I got Aww. a piece of the sleepy arms. You think you might get some more sleep? Maybe. Well, you're welcome to stay on stream as long as you'd like. I mean, I probably will. Maybe need the I for, will for long portions of this. It would be nice. Maybe I will. Maybe you will. Maybe I will. Will. Security system has been shut down. Will.
What? Oh, fuck now you. Come on. Victory. There we go. This music slaps so hard. Slap, slap. Ow! No! Oh no! <laughs> Babe, you gotta look out when that when that song starts slapping. <laughs> it like it like, takes no it prisoners. Like, yeah. All right. I should. Be Should be last one? There we go! Fuck you, dude! No, no, not <laughs> it's not nice! <laughs> I can't believe you would say that! That's Pride. not epic at all. Away again, thanks to you. <sighs> okay. <sighs> Hell yes. And I think we just 100% of the Marmalayer. Right, right off the bat, first run through. I'm so yeah. Proud of you, babe. Hell yeah. It's so epic. Oh, that's great. That's good to know. Good job. Is it hard being so cute and cool and good at video games? <sighs> yes. Like you wouldn't believe. I know. Let me just double check. Yep, got everything. I so uh, let's go back to Bikini Bottom. And you there. gotta go back to Bur Burkini Bottom. Burkini Bottom. Burkini Bottom. Burkini Bottom. <laughs> I think we need to. <laughs> In the future, not right now, because this is a marathon stream and the expectations are not at their highest. But in the future, <laughs> need to mm -hmm. need to adapt our jokes a little bit. I don't understand. Uh, it's I, I I can explain it later. It's fine. Okay. Shit. Well, that's not gonna work. Fuck this guy. Whoa! Oh, hey! Sock concert. That's cute. Ooh! Uh, 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 uh. What the fuck? Hold on! That was not something I had any time at all to jump on. There we go. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Yay! Beautiful. <laughs> this victory image is cut up by the chimney pipe. <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay, um... We're doing good. We're doing really good. What next? Uh, I like Sand Mountain more than I like Rock Bottom, so I might do Rock Bottom first just to get it out of the way. They got Rock Bottom in this game? Oh, they got Rock Bottom. Oh, that's just epic. It's it's real neat. Uh, Yeah, I'll do Rock Bottom. If I wanted to? No, actually, I couldn't just yet. Well, actually, maybe I could because I... Oh, I definitely have it. Yeah. If I wanted to, I could just turn these socks in to, to, to Patrick so I can get some more spatulas. Three to be exact, and then just do the next boss. But I'm going to do Rock Bottom first. I don't know why I felt I needed to explain that, but... <laughs> it's whatever. <laughs> Welcome to the dark depths of Rock Bottom. Home of Ooh. and souvenir features. Oh, SpongeBob! I'm. Oh. Ooh, Rock Bottom looks nice. It definitely um. I do like how Rock Bottom doesn't look particularly different from 
the original, it seems, but like it didn't need to. It's just it's just yeah. higher fidelity. I like that. I like that a lot. Oh, this just this just looks so good. Doesn't it? Jeez. Oh yeah. I, oh. Oh, I hate the sleepy time robots. Time for a little sleepy sneak. Okay, so current objective, I need to get all the paintings. So six paintings, only nine socks. That's great. I cannot believe that I that I am having such particular trouble with jellyfish fields of all things. To like to 100%. Like why is why is jellyfish field so fucking hard to get all the socks in? I've 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 scoured it like twice over already. Are you close to getting all of them? Yeah, I've, I I literally have like two. I think I have two more. Yeah, I literally have two socks left in jellyfish fields. There are fourteen total, and for some reason, those last two are kicking my ass. Sorry about your ass pain. It's okay. I wasn't using anything except for looking good. I feel like <laughs> you Hell yeah. Met the sponginator. I gotta say, Bubba Buddy. Say what? <laughs> they start what? Based on what, SpongeBob? <laughs> <laughs> Bubba Buddy, you're looking pretty base today. Based on what, SpongeBob? <laughs> Based on bubbles. <laughs> SpongeBob, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about, SpongeBob? That's my favorite fucking like like that that set of images from yeah. like like Breaking Bad with like Walt and Jesse at the diner. It's based, <laughs> Mr. White. <laughs> Jesse, what the fuck, what the are, fuck you are you talking about? <laughs> God, it's so good. Based on what? Jesse, what the fuck are you talking about? Yeah. In a perfect world, men like me would not exist. But this is not a perfect world. <laughs> what is that from? It's a YouTube video. It's from the same guy who does the potion seller video. <laughs> That's amazing. All of his videos are great. <coughs> and I, I I feel like I'm the only one who knows this. I'm not. But, but you know, it's just the, that occasional moment where, like, you know that something is good across the board and most people only talk about a portion of it. And you're like, no, wait, all of it's great. Yeah, no, I... <coughs> oh my god, sorry. Oh. Get some tea <coughs> and honey and lemon! I don't have any lemon. Ah, ah, ah. Order another grocery. <laughs> oh shit, you're right. I should have got lemon. Do you have any tea and honey at least? A tea, yeah. You should make some. <laughs> I will. What were you gonna say first? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking about, uh,. Knowing that something is good across the board, and then oh yeah oh yeah yeah like like that I I know what you mean I felt that way my entire life about Dom Ferrer's videos because yeah, most people only knew them for the laser collection and I'm like come on he makes musicals by himself oh god he does he's great I honestly not to, not to be a fangirl I can't believe I've done a podcast with him. I've I like, know. I've, I've loved his I'm, shit I'm, for so long, and like I've like, yeah. Now I've like collaborated with him. That that rules. That's wonderful. He's great. Yeah. Him and Tim both are are wonderful, wonderful boys. I would I would love to work with them more, honestly. Just my size. I love opening presents. That and the guy who made the uh the the boneless pizza meme. His videos are hilarious. Now I I don't I I am I am on the other side of that one. You haven't seen like other videos. I, I, by I haven't. Him? I, I I believe <sighs> I haven't seen many other. No. I'll show you a few. They're they're oh, yeah. like they're like they're like. 
I would say that they are similar in in quality. Like if you watched the videos, you would be like, oh yeah, this is definitely the boneless pizza guy. Um, they're just so like weird. Mm -hmm. I love them so much. They're great. They're they're great videos. Fresh like a spring breeze. Fresh like a spring breeze. Fresh like a spring breeze. <laughs> 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 <clears throat> oh roll 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 the sponge I can actually jump with SpongeBall now, so that makes that a lot easier. <laughs> I love that. I feel like I probably just missed a shitload of collectibles. That's okay. <clears throat> I can always go back. Go make yourself that tea, baby. I will. You should do it now. I'm playing Legend of Zegend right now. I will either. <laughs> it's an online game. I can't pause it. <laughs> I can't pause it. It's an online game. It's the new MMO for Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. God, can you oh, imagine? Oh, I was gonna say, a Legend of Zelda MMO. Holy shit. I literally, like, Breath of the Wild, in my opinion, would be the funniest. Like, maybe not MMO, but if you could have, like, like, like at least, like, like, 20 or more people in a world, yeah. that would be hysterical. That'd be great. That'd be the funniest shit in the universe. People already just use the engine as is to fuck around constantly, yeah. and I love it. I love Breath of the Wild. I want to play too. it again. I want to play a modded version of it once I get my new computer. Yeah, me too. I was thinking of doing the same wanna, thing pretty soon. I want to mod it the fuck up. I am. Um, I have a Wii U copy, which is what I used to play it modded. I I like I I kind of want to mod my Wii U. I don't know. I've never done it though. It's and not that I don't hard. Know how easy it is. Listen, babe. Like, if if I, I can do it, it's not that hard. <laughs> I'm just I'm terrified of doing anything to my Wii U because how do you replace a Wii U? <laughs> yeah. But like I I shit's come in the box busted. It is I, I like believe me. It is super 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 duper easy to 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 like homebrew a Wii U. Okay. Especially now that it's not being supported anymore. Like, there what? are there are hacks and exploits out the fucking wazoo. Okay. I'm interested. Mm hmm And also, um, you know, if you, if you mod a Wii U copy of Zelda rather than do it on an emulator, not only are you, like, pretty much guaranteed for it to run as intended, um... I mean, I, well, yeah, that's that's it. Like, it, you are yeah. guaranteed to run. You are guaranteed that the game will run as intended because you're playing it on the actual hardware still. You're just yeah. modding the files. So then you know, like, any errors would have to be from the mods. Yeah. Which is wonderful. And also, it just it feels really great to play a modded game on its original hardware. Like, it's super neat. I I'm going to get into modding uh, Game & Wario for the Wii U, just to make extra launching fronts levels. Because there's only like 30, and there needs to be like 50. That's a tragedy, yeah. I wouldn't know, though. I've never played launching fronts. Or any God, WarioWare. Babe, babe, we have to play launching fronts next time we're together. <laughs> I will bring game in Wario. Chat, do y'all know launching fronts? Just wondering. It's okay if you don't, but I will be disappointed and sad if you don't know launching fronts. <laughs> It's okay if you don't, but only if okay means really shitty and bad, and I'd be disappointed. <laughs> only if we change the definition of okay to not fucking okay. To not even fucking acceptable remotely. Uh, I could launch some fucking fronks right now. That is that is one game that, like, 
I, I truly suffer knowing there is no online capability at all. And like, it would benefit so much from that because like, I just, I fucking can't play it anymore. I just have the best game in the universe, like literally the best possible game in the universe <laughs> launching Franks. And I have no one to play it with because it's strictly multiplayer. What What is the what game? What am I supposed to, it's okay. So launching Franks is a competitive party game for Game & Wario for the Wii U, wherein there are these towers, right? Uh, and they have point values assigned to different, like, spots on the towers. Like, like every, like, level of the tower has a different point value. They, they have, like, different types of levels with, like, different types of towers and lots of fun little extra mechanics and stuff. Um, but basically, the idea of the game is you... Every, every person, up to like five people, picks a different color of fronks, which are these little funny guys with little funny faces. Oh, uh, I love little funny guys with funny faces. I'm right, already sold. yeah. Exactly. Um, so you got all these funny little guys with funny faces, and um, you basically put them in a giant slingshot. And to you, launch them? You launch them at these towers and try to land on these areas with these point values with a few stipulations one being that like other people shooting their fronks into yours can knock them off the platforms which is actually actively encouraged um okay and also if too many fronks are on the same space like if, if too like many all fronks. the players if all the players are trying to get like the highest point value and they all put their fronks on the same space uh the towers can tip over or collapse damn it is the best game ever. That, yeah, that sounds like a recipe for some good times. And I can't fucking do anything with it. I just have it. I have it and I carry the burden of knowledge that it is the best game ever and I cannot do anything with it. Sometimes pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. I truly live a tortured existence. I'm so sorry about that, babe. Would you, mind it's okay. if, would you mind if I got you a bratwurst hot dog to make up for it? I would love a bratwurst hot dog. Thanks, babe. Cool. Cool. Fuck. Time for a little sleepy sneak. Shit. Nope, oh, that's not that's not happening. What the fuck? No, 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 no! That's ridiculous. <laughs> You can just get caught in a goddamn loop. Death loop by uh, published by Bethesda. Death loop. What if Death loop was published by Bethesda? Babe, do I have some news for you? Ow. Fuck. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Is that the news? Yeah. <laughs> Might as well have been. Oh, that's really nice. That's a good painting. So I got to the part of Link's Awakening. Oh yeah, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at all the new paintings in this because in the original Ooh. game, they have really cool SpongeBob-related paintings everywhere. They have like what looks like concept art from the game and everything. Um, that's so awesome. And I assume it's all new here. Yeah, look at that. Oh, that's really good. Oh, uh, what the shit? Oh, I love it. I love it. Oh, hello. Oh, okay. He's right. Oh, okay. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? It's like, uh, uh, um, studios. <laughs> um. Yeah. Yeah, did you just see it? Yeah. Um, I just got to that part in Link's Awakening where you bring Marin to the little animal village and she, she sings to the little animals. So oh, basically, cute. I'm done with this game. Yeah. Like, I made it to the best Also, part, speaking so of cute, look at that! That must be, like, more. a kid's fan art or something. That's really cute. Aww! That's adorable! I if there's a way to, like, read the label. No, it doesn't seem like it. Oh, that's so sweet. Pretty. Oh, yeah, sock. Take it. Boy, Patrick will be glad to have this back. Two out of nine, okay. Not not ideal, but manageable. Manageable. Whoop. 
Shit. No, oh god, oh god, oh god. Come on. Hell yeah, babe. I'm pretty far behind, but hell yeah, babe. I saw you kill that robot. That was epic. Cool, thanks. He seemed like a real bastard. Glad, oh, he was a bastard. I'm glad you thought it was epic. No, you cannot spam Marble Sandwich Review. Fine, I will review my sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no no, no spam. Seriously, it's, it's, it, it is a chat roll. Yeah, it was turkey. I don't really like spam. God damn it. Sorry <laughs> to everyone who heard that. Everyone who had to hear that joke, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, I appreciate the thoroughness of that apology. Yeah, absolutely. Um, uh, my sandwich was pretty epic. I, I. <laughs> sorry, sorry. You want this review or not? <laughs> <laughs> it's just the the. It's a the pretty pure... epic sandwich. The, the 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 entirely genuine way in which you said that really got me. It was a really epic sandwich. Okay, so basically it was turkey and uh, avocado, just so much avocado, just so fucking much avocado, and so many pickles on that sandwich. Um, the and... essential marble sandwich staple is his pickles. Yeah, and so it had. It had cherry peppers, it had, uh, lettuce. Now wait, had... babe, did it have cherries or did it have peppers? You gotta make up your mind. Cherry peppers! Uh, I don't understand. <laughs> they're little hot peppers that look like cherries. Okay. Um, it had lettuce, it had mayonnaise. Um, I think that's it. And yeah, it's a good fucking sandwich. It slaps I'm... and it's good. I'm confused. This feels like it. Sh oh, oh, there's literally one right there. What the fuck? I I rate it uh uh 18 sandwiches out of 18. <laughs> it's an interesting rating scale. Could you maybe go into why that one? I'm sorry, what was the question? <laughs> why why a rating scale of 18? Uh, f for, for the 18 elements of Good Sandwich, specifically. What are those 18 elements? Right, okay. Yeah. The 18 elements off the top of my head, because I definitely know them by heart, because I just, I just know them, you know, in, in my heart and soul for my rating system. Uh... Uh, uh, mm -hmm. is it good? Is the first that's one? <laughs> is the first one? Okay, just sort Does of an taste... uh, just sort of an all encompassing. Yeah. yeah. Does it taste like a sandwich? Which is the second one. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, not to add more questions where they don't belong, but what what do you? How do you determine if something tastes like a sandwich? <laughs> Well, you know, it has to have like the elements like of sandwich gone. taste. Right. The rest. The, so like, the rest of the elements the, of yes, the eighteen elements. Exactly. Okay. okay. <laughs> exactly. So again, sort of an all-encompassing, <laughs> very reliant on the rest of the elements. Keep going. Um. Um. <laughs> that's two. All right. Out of eighteen. The third, the third one. The third element is does not have arsenic in it. Okay. That's three. That's yeah, an, that so seems like an important one. Hit the yeah, hit the third one right on right on the head. Hit the nail on the head. Uh, uh, haven't really encountered a sandwich that failed that rule yet. Um, and I well, hope I don't, but we'll see. <laughs> I'm not sure you would live to tell the tale if you did. Exactly. Rain, rain, um, away. that's kind of a given. Uh, right. The fourth, uh, is. <laughs> I'm already running out. Hang on. <laughs> the fourth is, uh, did I hang out with my GF while eating sandwich? And yes, I did. Interesting. Yeah. So, so you're so that improves this, the sandwich experience. I'm, I'm a, you, you've done yourself a favor 
for this bit, I will say, because now you have set the precedent that the elements of sandwich can also stretch outwards to the <laughs> context in, which, yeah, in yeah. which the sandwich was eaten. So you're giving yourself a lot of leeway there. And as an improv person, I appreciate that. Uh, so that's five, four out of 18. Five Number delivered five. to my house. I did not have to leave or get up, really. Okay. I mean, I had to get up to go get it, but like beyond that, you know. Right. Just very now, now the there. the perfect complete number five point score would be if if you did not have to get up at all. Right. If it materializes in my hand, then right. I don't have to move. Like no effort, vocal or otherwise. Yeah. yeah. Um. Uh, number six. Uh, is it has the crunch, and it did have the crunch for sure. What was what you know, was I thought that maybe the, the crunch. In this case. Well, I think I think the pickles were were, were a, a a big crunch factor. Com a component also, of crunch. Yeah. yeah, yeah. The bread crust actually was very crunch, and that was that was a really good element of nice. the sandwich. Yeah. What was that? Six, seven. That was seven, right? That was six. Seven. Uh, <laughs> seven. Lots of pickles. Mm -hmm. uh, any good sandwich needs lots of pickles. And seven <sighs> is, I think, maybe even more important than rule one and, and two combined. Okay. Um, uh, and what were rules rule... one and two again? <laughs> rule one was, does it taste good? Okay. <laughs> and then... Rule two was, does it taste like a sandwich? Right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um... Rule what you're, say, what you're saying, if it has a lot of pickles, that almost overrides the necessity of the first two. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. You, you don't need it to taste like a sandwich. As or long taste as... good, necessarily, yeah. as long as it has yeah. a lot of pickle yeah. taste in it. <laughs> <laughs> um, number eight. Or wait, what was that eight? That Shit. was number that was seven. seven. That was yeah, seven. Yeah, so you All are right. on number eight. Eight. Um... Uh, did it remind me of a better time? And I think it, most certainly it did. It reminded me of a time when I had the sandwich like a week ago, and I was like, hey, this is really good. Now, was that time measurably better than this time right now, when you had the sandwich now? No, because this time I was hanging out with you. Okay, so it didn't meet that criteria then. Right, right. <laughs> it, that was like a 17 out of 18, honestly. Okay. Because I wasn't hanging out with my Well, GFL then you lied either. earlier when you said it was an 18 out no, of 18. No, no, no. The one that no, the one I got today was an oh. 18 out of 18. The one that it reminded me of. Right, but 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 was... but th that's almost paradoxical, because if the other sandwich was 17 <laughs> out of 18, and this sandwich was 18 well, no, out of 18, no, hang on. Then, Let me then, explain my then reasoning. This, then this sandwich wouldn't meet criteria eight of reminding you the of a time better itself. time. The time itself could have been better, though, because I was in good health. Now I'm coughing up a storm, you know, just because <laughs> the sandwich wasn't as good because it was only 17 out of 18, which, by the way, is not due to its taste, but just due to the fact that we were hanging out at the moment. Um, <laughs> but just like of a better of a better, like state of mind, maybe, you know, mm hmm. I'll, I'll, I'm really, I'll, really, really I'll, sleepy today. So, I'll let this you know. one slide. Yeah, no, <laughs> yeah. I got you. <laughs> Much like SpongeBob on this funny big slide. Yes. That you're okay, on. Uh, number eight. No, that was number eight. That was. <laughs> I'm keeping track now. Number nine. I'm counting on my fingers now, cool. so I don't lose track. Uh, uh, number nine. Uh, uh, did I stay hydrated? Did I drink water while eating the sandwich? And I did. I did very much so drink water while eating the sandwich. That's good. Um, really just should be a, a proponent of a healthy life in general, not even just a good sandwich experience. Yeah, but you know what? Most people don't do that. Most people uh, don't drink water because it's uh, clear liquid. <laughs> and you, you can't... <laughs> and, you, you can't <laughs> remark to your peers you about all the funny can't. blue in it. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you can't trust that shit. You know what else is clear liquid? Uh, isopropyl alcohol, and if you drink that, you'll die. Oh, say it ain't so. So, number 10. Yeah. Number 10. Um, number 10 is one that I definitely just remember so well, but I'm, you know, just gonna ruminate on it a bit, mm -hmm. just to ramp up to it, just so you're like, 
Yeah, it's suspense. So it must be it must be a really important and impactful rule and will be very easily recognizable as such. Did I stop doing something worse to eat the sandwich? <laughs> and I did stop playing Crash Bandicoot for a while to eat the sandwich. So yes. Now is yeah, and so you're now claiming that Crash Bandicoot playing Crash Bandicoot is measurably worse than eating an 18 out of 18 sandwich. That, that oh checks. yeah, absolutely. That checks out. Yeah. Well, like that tracks. maybe not like maybe not like not, maybe not like the base game of Crash Bandicoot, but trying to get all those gems and those uh, sapphires and shit and the time trials. Uh, that's 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 demonstrably worse than anything you could put yourself right. through in 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 a, in sandwich format. You know. Yeah. <clears throat> it makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Um, let's see, eight, uh, 11, I'm sorry, 11 out of 18 is, did I take my meds today? I did take my meds today. Um, I specifically remember doing it. I took all of my meds and I even, uh, reordered a prescription that I needed. So I'll have more meds tomorrow that, that I need to replace. Cool. So, um, yeah, so that's, that's, that's like a done deal. That's good. Um, <laughs> Uh, let's see, let's see. What's number 12? I mean, obviously I know it by heart. I'm just, uh, you know, like I said, ramping There's up to it. Like mm -hmm. you know. in right, it, it's, it, you weren't asking what is number 12. You're, it was more of like a, like a call It's like suspense. introducing the like, concept. Like, yeah, so what like, is so, number 12? So what is number 12? <laughs> so what is number 12? <laughs> so what is number 12? <laughs> oh, okay, I see. The more times you say that, the more it ramps up suspense, and that's how it works. Right, that's ex that's exactly right, babe. Um, number 12 is... Uh... 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 <laughs> oh, a spiceability factor, so it's gotta have that spice. Spiceability factor? Spiceability factor, so it's gotta have the spice. Add mm -hmm. cherry peppers, it did have the spice. Um... Honestly, I gotta say, could have had more spice. Maybe I should have asked oh. for more peppers. But I'd still say that it met the requirement, you know? Yeah, for like an it, 18 it, out of 18. It met what it needed to do. Right, to no, do. yeah, just just because something gets the highest score possible doesn't mean it's perfect. Nothing is perfect. Nothing is perfect. Except for launching frogs for for the Wii U. Right, but that's neither here nor there. Right. Unfortunately, so number 13. I wish it was everywhere. No, number 13 is, is it absolutely fucking slathered? You're not going to like this one. Uh, with avocado. <laughs> yeah. Um, and it definitely met that uh, met that criteria. It just, it, there's so much fucking avocado on the sandwich. Right. I, I ordered extra, and it's like they knew that I wanted more than just extra. I wanted a sandwich that was primarily avocado with other <laughs> ingredients inside of it. So... They get that. They, they 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 definitely hit that that number thirteen spot perfectly. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, fourteen. Uh, did Aubergine try to fuck with it before I ate it? And no, he didn't this time. Actually. Whoa. So that's like that's like perfect. That's once like, in a lifetime. I almost yeah, once in a lifetime. I never get that. Aubergine always tries to take the sandwich. He tries to bite the sandwich. He tries to lick the sandwich. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. <laughs> so that, you know, fair. I I I, <laughs> yeah. I I nary think any of us would. Right. Um. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, I did just plummet. You were DTP. Mm hmm. DTP. You okay? You look kind of. DT down to plummet so much. <laughs> um, number fifteen is the Burger King foot lettuce. Exactly. It did have it. It did have Burger King foot lettuce in it, and by that I mean lettuce. It didn't actually have right. lettuce that somebody stepped on. Um, but it had lettuce in it. Honestly, like, I'm not a big fan of lettuce, but, like, but, like, it was good, you know? It added the crunchability factor even, even yeah. to, even to that a little bit. On a you know, sandwich, I itself. tend to prefer spinach over lettuce, but, like, I don't, I don't, yeah. I don't dislike lettuce. 
Right. No, like, well, spinach has more flavor. Mm -hmm. And in my case, uh, too much potassium because my sandwich was, as I said, already f just fucking slathered with avocado. With avocados and pickles, which, you know, are, are in this case, in, in terms of the 18 by 18 scale, yeah. are more important than any of the remaining flavors. Yeah. Exactly. Um... Uh, number 16, um, uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, oh, number 16, did I tip my fucking driver? Absolutely I did. Absolutely. Fucking, I've never missed that one ever in my life. Tip your goddamn delivery drivers. Hell yeah. And if, if you're, if you're ordering just, like, one sandwich, okay? Like, you're ordering, like, one sandwich, 20% is not enough. I'm sorry, they still have to go the same distance. Maybe even more, depending on how far away you live. Just because, just because it says, oh, 20% of this $8 sandwich is, is two bucks, doesn't mean that that's a good tip. Right. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta go the extra mile. Like, just, just, just do a $5 tip. It's, it's not hard. Whoa! Holotones! Holly is rating with a party of 186! Holly, thank you! Hi! Oh, great! Wonderful! What a great time for everybody to come in here while I am <laughs> just naming off this, uh, this rubric. Very, very previously sand... prepared and well put together sandwich grading scale that Marble has yes. always followed and is definitely not just coming up with on the spot. Right. I've always had this this rubric available when judging sandwiches and and how good they are. We're currently we we currently listed uh, up to rule sixteen out of eighteen. We're about to, out of out of eighteen, because the sandwich that I had earlier today was an eighteen out of eighteen. So I have to list every number of of the scale and and what it what it's all about. So number uh, seventeen. Really quickly, can I can I do my like housekeeping talking about? Oh, why absolutely. Yes. Are yes. Yeah. Right please. Um, yeah. So for those of you who are just joining, whether from Holly or, or from someone else, um, I, hi, my name is Penny and I am currently working towards uh, raising money over the next couple weeks to move out of my parents' home for the first time ever. Um, it is a it is a big amount that I'm gonna need to, to make sure that it is able to happen. Uh, I was able to work it into a 15,000 minimum. Um, I understand, I'm very self-aware that that is not a small amount at all. Um, which is why I'm doing it over, you know, a long period of time. This is definitely not something I'm expecting in one stream. Um, but it is very, very important to me. And it has been something that I have wanted to see happen for such a long time. Um, and, and, you know, I asked people if, if they would be comfortable with me, uh, you know, using my platform to, to help out and, uh, or help myself out and I guess let people help me out. Um... And, you know, I, the response was overwhelmingly positive, and so I'm doing that. Uh, so that is currently what every donation during the stream is going towards. Um, you know, obviously, as as always, no one is ever obligated or pressured to donate uh, or, or, you know, even support me at all, like, financially or otherwise. If, if it's not something that you can do, that is absolutely fine. Um, but it is, you know, it's it's gonna it is gonna improve my life so much to make this happen, um, in ways that I have literally only dreamed of for like fucking years upon years. Um, like it, it's 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 incredibly special to me the fact that I am even close to making this happen right now. And um, yeah, uh, so anything at all you can spare, that is what the donation goal is for. That is what it will continue to be for for the next couple weeks. Um, if if people could help me reach my goals, like I, I I I can almost guarantee it would it would show it would show its it would show its face in my actual content as well as just like my general happiness and like life presence, like just because like I will be in a space where like I can manage my own time and my environment and like that is something I have literally never had before and is just. I don't know, just just really, really important to me, um, and is something I have I have needed for a very long time, uh, and yeah. So, all that to say, that's what donations are going for right now. That's that's why we're doing this particularly special stream. Uh, yeah, in terms of stream context, by the way, if you're curious, I am currently trying to get the platinum trophy for SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated, which just came out today. 
um, in one sitting, <laughs> uh, one stream at least. Uh, and that's not an easy feat, but I'm still trying it because I have no chill whatsoever. So, uh, yeah, that's what's going on. Hell yeah! Thank you so much, everybody, and thank you, Holly. It was it it's, it was so nice to see you, Raid. That was really really sweet of you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. So number seventeen on the on the sandwich rating scale does <laughs> require a fair amount of precognition, because um, it's actually uh, it's actually number seventeen is did Twitch user uh, Twitch.tv slash Holotones uh, raid with a party of <laughs> one hundred sixty or greater. See, there's a little leeway there. Right. Okay. Um, that's good. That's uh, good. While you, you, were you always explaining... want you always want reasonable leeway yeah. in the grading scale. Yeah. While you were explaining the rules of sandwich, and lastly is number eighteen, um, which is uh, kind of a subjective one, I think. Um, unlike the rest of these, which are all purely based on uh, facts and logic. Mm -hmm. um, oh, what the uh, fuck! That was bullshit. Uh, <laughs> sorry. The... <laughs> Sorry, I just saw the way he like it, it's like the opposite of a rag doll. Yeah. He j he like bricked himself. Well, and then he just appeared again. Like there was just a new one right there. I could probably do this yeah. with Sandy pretty well. He just well, like SpongeBob when he when he ran out of life points or whatever happens in this game, he like he just like <laughs> became stiff as a board and just and just like fell to the floor. It was fucking incredible to watch. Um, so this rule 18 is is a subjective one, um, and uh, I'm personally not going to reveal like what my personal answer to this is uh, because I feel like that kind of takes some of the subjectivity out of it. Like I don't want to influence other people's answers to this question, and it's do you believe in the afterlife? <laughs> and like I said, I'm not going to say if I do or don't, but that's number 18. That's okay. that's the 18th. Wow. Piece of the of the rating scale. And that's that's it? And that, and that's how you determine if the sandwich is an 18. Nothing out about of 18. uh nothing about like, I don't know, bread quality <laughs> condiments, <laughs> if any. I feel like a new spot. That's a really good idea, babe. You should make a sandwich rating scale. <laughs> Super not hard. As it turns out, nobody can stop you from doing it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and in fact, <coughs> some might even push you to do it, despite the fact that you would like to stop yourself. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, we're almost at 4,500. Holy shit. Oh, That's thank amazing. You, thank you so wow. much, everybody. I see four 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 uh yeah. point zero four. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. I've been seeing those fours recently. <laughs> Y'all are such epic gamers. Okay, well, I mean Lasers are fun and good for you. <laughs> I'm mm, rock bottom might be another one of the more confusing ones to 100%. They can be, yeah. Ever heard of fucking uh, laser hair removal? What's up, dude? Hey, Mr. Krabs, what are you doing? Just hey, you know, know, how's it going? Slip sliding away, let's do this. Hiya! Slip uh. sliding away! Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. So yeah, hopefully you can use this rubric to judge whether or not your sandwich is like actually good or if it's just complete fucking garbage. Yeah. 
I, I, I mean, I imagine it's gonna be very useful to a lot of people, babe. Thank you so much for sharing this scientific grading scale of science. Yeah, well, it's all, it's all, it's all like you know, objective science. except for number eighteen, of course. Yeah, which is mostly opinion based. Um. But yeah, I just want people to be able to like properly, because like you know, a lot of like a lot of food grading scales uh, by like professional reviewers like re relies on like you know, like just very uh, big words that I don't understand, <laughs> and just I, I figured I'd make something a little bit more accessible. Yeah. Sometimes you just need a grading scale that's just full of inane concepts and <laughs> yeah, weird connections where they otherwise wouldn't yeah. be yeah seemingly random as if made up on the spot but of yeah. course as obviously. if but not truthfully right right obviously these were all uh, developed in, yeah. painstakingly over time yeah over over years and years of food service work yep you need to know how a burnt quesadilla measures up well it can measure up any way. It just depends on if it meets those those qualities that I listed. I can't rate it for you. You're the one that knows. Especially with number 18. Like, yeah. I have no idea where you stand with that. <laughs> <laughs> and hey, I mean, like, like you put your hands over. Hey, that's not... That's not that's... I don't want to speak for you in that one. <laughs> yeah, never ever. That's something that you have to find within yourself and decide for your own self and decide for within yourself, and your own self decides for itself within itself. I'm glad you understand, babe. Oh, even when I'm speaking for him, he doesn't make sense. Is the Avatar I joke. see some people asking about specific rules, uh, and people who want to hear the rules again. Watch the VOD, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, stepping outside of the bit trying to come up with 18 different ways in which a sandwich can be considered good or bad on the spot. Like oh no, I just meant it's, it's not worth my time. You know, I worked really oh, okay. hard to convey these to people and I just really don't appreciate that some people weren't listening or paying attention. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Well, hey, stand up for yourself. We're already almost at six hours of this stream and, oh man, there's still quite a bit to go. Fuck. That's okay. That's okay. I, I honestly, here's the thing. We're definitely um, at risk of cutting it close in certain areas, but also I still feel like I can do this. I believe in you. Thanks. You're welcome. There's, okay. That is worrying me though. I have the art pieces, so I might as well go ahead and turn that in to Mrs. Puff. If there's nothing that's right here. Now you may ask me, Penny, how are you gonna turn paintings into a SpongeBob character? And it's what I like to call a little bit of magic. <clears throat> we turned paintings into a SpongeBob character in Drawn to Life SpongeBob Edition. We did. When does Penny get her next break? Uh, I, I, I am. I am pacing myself by taking a, a short break, um, or a short break at least, um, every two hours. Um, this next one might be longer a little bit. Uh, not by much, but, like, it might be just a little bit longer, just given the fact that it's dinner time and I will not be stopping anytime soon, so I need to, you know, get some food in my system. Um, <clears throat> but, um, yeah, uh, every two hours or so, I take a break. And then uh, when I come back from break, I catch up on reading some donations that we got during the last section, or even in the sections before, just depending on how behind we are. Um, and then we go from there, and just so on and so forth. I, ooh, ooh, there's a spatula up there. Fuck, all right, well. That seems like not the way. I might get some blop eyes for dinner. That sounds yummy. It wouldn't be the most in line with my diet, but like I said earlier, I'm gonna be a little bit more relaxed with that yeah, be, today. Just be good to yourself today. I just want some chicken in my body. You know? 
Yeah. Okay, this shit needs to end. Actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just go this way. Sometimes pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. Up for a game of SpongeBob. What? What's up here? Oh. Oh. Okay. Well. Oh, no, I need Sandy. I need Sandy. Where is this? This one is probably... Uh, this one's probably what this one is. Right? Maybe. All right, well, where's the nearest swap? I don't have much time before my break. I need to find this pretty quickly. Oh, it's up here. It's pretty easy. Ah! Fuck. Fresh like a spring breeze. <laughs> Get some chicken, Holly. You gotta get some chicken. You gotta get some chicken. What do you think you're doing if you didn't get chicken? And that's that's not even one of the that's not even one of the eighteen points. Sandwich so rolls. You could you could still you could still meet the the eighteen criteria. Yeah, just like in a separate portion of the meal. Yeah. I hope you like avocado. <laughs> I don't, so unfortunately, I can apparently never have an 18 out of 18 sandwich. Oh yeah, you do need to raid yourself with a party of 160 or more, though. Or else you, the oh, highest that's true. you can get yeah. is a 17 out of 18. Yeah, it's, it's weird how that requirement is, like, so specific down to the, to the point that, like, Holly is specifically named in the rule. Yeah. And also, like, I knew it was an 18 out of 18, like way before it happened how did mm. how does that work huh? how does that how does that fucking work precognition baby Ooh. i just know stuff before it happens because i paid attention in class and took notes took nose whose nose you know people need those not anymore fuck <laughs> What the fuck, babe? <laughs> <laughs> you know that's not true, right? <laughs> you know people sitting in either noses? You know that, right? Like, you know that? Babe. I don't know if I agree. <laughs> I, <laughs> I respectfully disagree. <laughs> okay. Y'all... Y'all know I saw a fucking golden spatula over here. Where is it now? Or did I see it somewhere else? No, I definitely- I saw it, like, over here. Right? Oh, no, it was over there! It wasn't over here! It was over there! <laughs> it was his hat, Mr. Krabs! He, he was, was number one! one. He was number one! He was number one! Oh. Oh, wait. There we go. Wait, shit. Shit. Oh, I can't believe I'm gonna, like, actually cook a difficult meal tonight. I yeah. can never do that, ever. I'm excited for you. I am. I'm very excited to try it. Um, mainly because I just, like, I just really want this fucking uh, pork bowl from 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 Mitsua, and I can't go there anymore because it's a mall, and that's like the least safe place to be right now. Mm -hmm. But I really, really fucking want one. Well, so bad. I hope you can make the best of it. 
I'm oh, I'm so confused. I'm prepared for it not to taste anything like the one that I get there, but as long as it's still like kind of good at least, I'm like fine with it. Right. Oh, maybe I can get to it from here. <gasps> Come on. No. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, and that was the secret one. Good. Okay, that that feels nice. I I didn't I didn't end up getting. Let's go take a look at that. I Lasers still are fun and good for you, babe. They are. So I have a grading scale for that. Uh, yeah, but it's one out of one, and is it good? That's it. Okay. So it seems like I got. Oh oh. Let me talk to. Yeah, okay. I just need to talk to Frank again. Oh, yeah. Okay. And then. To Mrs. Puff. And then, um, I can probably fill in the rest of the socks when I get back from break. Are you about to take a break? Yeah. I might hop off here and come back later. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I just I'm gonna I'm gonna take some time to chill out and stuff. Yeah, absolutely. Um, yeah, you, you've been on for almost the whole time, so no worries. Yeah, thanks you thanks thanks so much for having me. I'm so fucking proud of you. Thank and you. Yeah, I'll 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 be I'll be back later. Thank you for coming on, baby. I I, I really appreciated the company. Yeah, absolutely. I love keeping you company. Hell, I'm like. I'm like gay for you and stuff. I'm like, oh, you need to do something else. Oh my god, oh my god, hang on, oh my god, what the fuck? Also, look at this. Oh, I do kind of. I do kind of not like how they turned it into like a dedicated cutscene rather than just like a fun little moment. Oh, in the original, it wasn't like a cutscene. Cut yeah, scene. in the original, it's not a moment. It's just a, uh, it's just a little thing that happens when you walk near the candy thing. That's it's fun. it's really great. Oh, uh, all right. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and go on break. I, it's a little early. It's like seven minutes early, but also I'm I'm gonna take that time to like order food and whatnot. So, uh, okay, I will be back uh pretty shortly. Um, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna wait until my food gets here, because that's gonna take, like, anywhere from, like, 20 to 30 minutes, probably. So, I will, I'll just, I'll, you know, I'll, I'll step away for a second when the food gets here. I'll, I'll probably yeah. eat it while I'm streaming, if that's okay with everybody. Um. It's okay with me, personally. Cool, that's honestly all I need. <laughs> yep. Um, and then, uh, yeah, but, uh, yeah, so, real short break incoming. Um, stretch your legs, everybody, get some refreshments, take care of yourself real quick. Uh, and uh, we'll be back really soon with uh, more SpongeBob. All right. Goodbye, goodbye. Bye. Goodbye, goodbye. Well, bye in Marble <gasps> Case, but just bye for now in my case. Goodbye, BRB. <laughs> <laughs>